YouTube, what's the deal? It's your boy Gangland Neiman, aka Neiman I before the E. Golly, I don't know y'all, and we back with another video. So look, <clears throat> the homie asked me, he like, yo, who is six hundred? This dude. Woo -woo. Now, I don't know. I never heard of him, right? But um, I keep seeing these videos where he just popping up. He talking about big you, this, that, and the other. Woo -woo -woo -woo. So anyway, I look into bro a little bit. This is box, uh, boxingrecords.com, and here bro is, you feel me? Um, Christopher Jamal Lovejoy, um, his alias is Pretty Boy, uh, 40 years of age from the U.S., Orthodox, 6'5", um, he's from Las Vegas, or he, he, he lives in Vegas, he's from L.A., you know what I'm saying, and that's that. So, um... That's what I seen on bro. Now we're gonna get into this clip real cl quick. Um, this is a clip from bro on No Jumper. And uh <clears throat> I'll be honest with you, I don't know what him and um Big U got going back and forth or what he got, because it just seems like a bunch of him firing off on Big U. I don't know what they got going, but um I don't agree with the way he's approaching this. You feel me? Cause you making some crazy um insinuations and allegations you know what i mean but um let's get into this clip real quick hey, oh we got more okay not too long ago big u was kind of like you know oh, seeing boy, his he was seeing his name you know what i'm saying not really doing too good in the world right he want to call he want to call people i know and say oh man he think you this he won't get in the gloves with me i'm like bro he told you that oh like, yeah using the phone right yeah, I thought three or four people on the phone. I took about three on the phone. So you say I won't get in the gloves with you. I got 50 bands on me. Oh. We can get in the gloves. We can get in the gloves. You say I won't get in the gloves with you. We can get in the gloves. I'm going to bad you. Winner take all. You bring your 50, I bring my 50. However you want to do it. And this, and this ain't no bully type call out shit. You told me I won't get in the gloves with you. That's what he told me. Mm -hmm. That's what he told them about me. So this ain't no made up shit. Me trying to bully him, I'm gonna call your bluff. What's up? When we doing it? I got my I got my fifty right here. <clears throat> All right. So, um, long story shorter, you feel me? This guy, six hundred, aka Christopher Lovejoy, the boxer. It's calling Big U out on all kind of things. Him and Big U was formerly friends. You feel me? Um, let me see if I got this video right here. Y'all walk with me for a second. It's raining like a motherfucker out there. You hear me? Let's see if I got this video. Yeah, I do. Um, so this is a video. Um, this is just months ago. You know what I mean? That's why this shit. What I believe is is, is what Christopher Lovejoy is doing is a tricky thing. You know what I'm saying? Um, prayers out to everybody because niggas is playing dangerous games and and, and you get dangerous prizes for that kind of shit. You know what I'm saying? Um, let's get to this video real quick. Now, this is um, this is Big U. This is Eugene with Christopher Lovejoy just months ago. You know what I'm saying? But um, peep this. This one, 100 now. part one. We ain't cutting no grass. We ain't cutting no grass? No, we ain't cutting no grass. <laughs> <laughs> Night I don't know about that thunder dog. <laughs> Somebody said they pull up. Oh, she pull up? No, it's a, it's a female. Well, she can pull up too. Then she can come get a picture with a champ. Listen, man, I don't think y'all know this, bro. If anybody got anything to say about the big homie, because I'm on him. Like I told y'all before, anybody well, you better got, start if, acting like that. Anybody got anything to say about the big homie? He said, anybody got anything to say about the big homie? I'm on him. I'm on him. You know what Eugene said? Eugene said, you better act like it. I'm on him. The you better start acting like that. The internet. Look, you know what's up. We in the hood. Now that's that. You feel me? Like I said, that was months ago. I got videos of him with um, Brick Baby on um, essentially the same type timing. You feel me? Like they was... All posted up, throwing up gang signs and shit, and um, 
And now niggas is doing expose videos on the internet about them. You know what I mean? And and again, you know what I'm saying? I said that in other videos. I think all that hood shit that niggas is doing on the internet is corny. You know what I mean? Um, <clears throat> it's no offense and all offense to niggas because for real, like, keep that shit where it's at. Niggas, like myself, civilians, you feel me? Niggas who's upstanding citizens, who don't, who got business and some more shit. Niggas who don't, who not into none of that. I don't give a fuck about that shit, for real, because in the real world, it don't make no fucking difference. You feel me? It makes zero difference. But anyway, um, Christopher Lovejoy in the No Jumper interview, he 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 spoke on how, like, you know what I'm saying? He went over to um he went over to Tijuana and beat up on uh, on on a bunch of uh weak Mexicans. That's not a um diss, but I'm saying that like like that's literally what they were they was it was padding for his record you know what i'm saying so he went over there and knocked all kind of niggas out let's go back over here to this thing real quick before we get into this um his record real quick um 22 fights 20 ko's he got knocked out once and then it was uh one by decision it looked like okay yeah so that's what it is you look here and all the fights was under he he got them all in the first round, 206, uh, 50 seconds, 42 seconds, 248. And some of these are he was whooping on them so hard that the ref just caught it. You feel me? So anyway, but that that's what they are. They, they're they not real. They not nice. The niggas who he's beating up, they not nice. You feel me? So um, that was bro record. He talks about how he went over there to do that. That's what's funny to me. I don't uh, understand because he's talking like the big hands. And all of 50 grand for the hands and all that right now. And then um, you see things like this. But um, that's what we going to do. We going to get into this just a little bit of this fight. We're going to skim through this fight. This is uh, one of bro's last uh, professional fights. It's Christopher Lovejoy, a.k.a. 600. This is one of his last professional fights. You know what I'm saying? And we're going to um, let's just tap in with this right quick and just see what them hands do. You know what I mean? We've never seen fight. Um, I've seen 30 seconds of the lad, and he looked terrible. Um, he has no trainer, no cut man, nothing. This ring looks like it's inside of some gymnasium. Lovejoy's head is nearly touching the ceiling, as you can see. And it looks like a light bulb is dangling just above them. And they're off. Lovejoy, straight away, into the center of the ring with Char, at a very slow pace. Char... Char threw a feint and Lovejoy instantly bites on the feint. Char hasn't fought in just about four years, ladies and gentlemen. His last fight, a victory over Alexander Ustinov. That's a good jab there from Lovejoy. That was a nice jab. Lovejoy maintaining center of the ring, looking to slowly back down Char. Char just touches him to the belly and says, Okay, I know that you're fat. I'm going to work that guy. He's in gross shape here, Lovejoy, at 307 pounds. So he's definitely, if he lands on Char... <laughs> With all of that weight, he should be able to do some damage. Char just having a look. He hasn't fought in quite a while. Lovejoy using the jab, dissecting the guard. A little head feint from Lovejoy, showing us some things. Doesn't have much defense. Char not throwing anything. Char ducking down and getting there. So Lovejoy knows how to box to some extent, as we can see here. Nothing, nothing special. Nice little jab there from Lovejoy, straight through the guard, guard of Char. Referee has a word with Lovejoy. This nigga backslapped the nigga, back the, back the nigga like, what the fuck? Tron. It's a good hooking technique there from Lovejoy. Oh my god, he's sloppy as all hell. <laughs> Char is slowly going to start working him down. I'm waiting for the moment where one of these detonators from 19 and all 19 KO Lovejoy hits our screens. I am looking forward to that for sure. Okay, still a battle of a jab here. Char slowly starting to back him down. Lovejoy showing a little bit of good reflex. Nice little lead hook there. Lovejoy says, no, that doesn't hurt, and he's touching his cheek. Manuel Char was able to hurt Lovejoy with one slap. There wasn't much on that, no torque. He, had a, he hurt him a little bit there. He responded, not a great poker face from Lovejoy. Char, who hasn't fought in so long, just keeping a nice guard, getting the uppercut right in, getting the, <laughs> the shot. hand's not jumping out to me. As Lovejoy know. felt that shot to the stomach, Lovejoy instantaneously clenching. He hugging he up, doing the whole hug, dance here. and all that. Lovejoy doesn't know how to hold a clench legally. This is That's an illegal clench. clench. Referee's telling you him to You arguing, trying to get your breath. Lovejoy not breaking. 
This is a dude who's... N I, I don't think he knows how to fight, ladies and gentlemen, if I'm being honest with you. That's a good job there from Char. Lovejoy is winging it. He's probably trained a little bit. Had a couple of fights against nobody, but he doesn't belong in here. Unless he lands one punch, he's going to get put to sleep in the next two. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the same guy on the couch with Adam style. 22 with the Dodgers jersey on, looking there. super fucking cool, with fifty thousand dollars. Look at this. This is nasty it. work. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This is on his Lovejoy channel too. He's not ashamed really of this. You know what I'm saying? This is on his oh, channel. You feel me? Lovejoy is crying. He's crying. <laughs> the big baby is crying. Oh my, my god. <laughs> I'm so sorry, folks. We interrupt that to bring you some much more respectful commentary as Lovejoy took a very painful punch there and it really, really hurt him. So Lovejoy went for a clinch and somehow really, really hurt himself, falling to his knees. This happens when you have to be off be balance, not in shape. Land on your knees. It's he going falls and hurts himself. This is wow, but this for is the second round. Lovejoy this is the guy. Very sad, very emotional. That's wild. It's a super They're already watering him down. He telling Big U that he, he, he got up. 50 stacks for the hands? For As real? Mahmoud, stands Ask up and says a prayer. That's crazy. Because he knows Lovejoy can't deal with him. This now, must Lovejoy's be um, saying, Knock him out, Christopher. artificial him intelligence. Out. But that's not going to work. <laughs> you got this is artificial intelligence. Lovejoy is in trouble. Lovejoy with the heavy shots, but man, this is AI. Away. Hits him with a jab. Clinching this him, is AI. Down on him. No problem for chair as they break. This is Chat GPT video. Over. Referee has a word. There's no way this is Christopher again. Lovejoy 600. Lovejoy looking six oh nine bull. The job. No There's no way. There from Lovejoy comes for the quick one too, but Char steps off a very noisily as Lovejoy coming in for the kill with the big overhand right. Manuel Char felt that. So that was good pressure there from Lovejoy with the big shot. As Manuel Char clinches him, hits him to the body. Lovejoy showing every emotion on his face. Maybe Lovejoy's starting to feel this now. Lovejoy's probably thinking, I can do this. It's a good jab from Manuel Char. A nice jab back from Lovejoy. Lovejoy's taking those jabs as though they're power shots. Overhand from Lovejoy. Left hook to the body from Char. And a left hook upstairs. The right hand and down goes Lovejoy. <laughs> he's on his knees. He couldn't take it. He's going to quit. There's no way he stands up. Does he stand up? Does he hey. give it the good one? Or does he take the knee and take and the no money cap, and leave? And no cap, ladies and gentlemen. And that is like actually the end of this. You feel me? That's the end of the, the, this fight. That's the way that this fight ended. You know what I mean? This is Christopher Lovejoy, 600, neighbor, neighbor, all that. You know what I mean? Um, like I said, I don't be looking at paperwork, and I don't know what paperwork you got. If you got paperwork in here, that, that's for y'all to figure out. You feel me? But this is just the stuff that I saw when I looked him up. I saw a bunch of Big U videos, and then I saw, like, his boxing shit. And, you know, pretty good record in boxing, but even in the video, he talked about he didn't fight nobody. You know what I'm saying? And, um... We could see that. He had, he had 20, 22 bum fights. You know what I'm saying? He had 22 bum fights that um, he, he basically breezed through. And then he got, uh, and then he got knocked out in, in that fight. So, you know what I'm saying? That's 600. Um, if y'all know any more information, y'all let me know. Um, again, what I think he doing is real dangerous. I think he's stupid. Um, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm from LA. I'm from the hood. I know how this kind of shit go. Like, I don't understand why you would feel comfortable putting your hood business online like that anyway. I say that shit about Brick Baby all the time. Like, we get to him later. This, this nigga got a, this nigga Brick Baby got a, Show called No Statements where he make all the statements in the world. But that's a whole nother thing. But yeah, 600 is going against, you know what I'm saying, his own. And he's doing it in, in on the internet. He's doing it with WAC 100, the messiest nigga on the internet or in the streets. You feel me? But I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Y'all let me know if y'all think that 600 got the hands to see Eugene. Y'all think 600 got the hands to see you, G? Because, because I don't think he do. Again, like, subscribe, comment. Um, let me know what you think. This your boy Gangland Neen. Peace.